Hello church, my name is Bamishe Alabi. I really want to thank the Lord for what he's doing in my life. Uh, most especially what God um, did in my life through Apostle J.B. Adams. You know, I got a call about a month ago uh, from my spiritual father, an instruction from my spiritual father to come and work in the ministry in Kwara State. And so, but at that point, it was really not what I was thinking about. That was just my eighth month in um, Lokoja and I was just planning to settle down in Lokoja. I was just, that was just all I was thinking about. So it was a great burden and so I could not even pray about it sincerely. Uh, but one thing I did was to approach, um, oppose to and seek for counsel. But to my surprise, the moment I told oppose to, oppose to told me to carry my bag and start moving. I was like, oh, Jesus. <laughs> but what, what I learned at that point was obedience because Apostle also prayed for me and spoke into my finances. That point, at that point, my finances were so, so bad. I was struggling financially. And one thing I prayed about when I began to pray about um, my movement, because I didn't even have money to move. I didn't even have money to pack. So... The moment I began to pray, I was trusting God for signs. And according to what um, Apostle had prayed for me, laid hands on me, and had prayed for me, that week, that same week when I, was, when I was to move, that same week was the first time I got the biggest design job I ever got in my life before then. Then immediately I got to Kwara State again, Ilorin Kwara State again. God connected me to an architectural firm in Enugu State, Somehow, somehow, I didn't know them from anywhere, but somehow I just got connected. And for over three weeks now, I've been doing one project to another, one project to another for them. I really want to thank the Lord because God really, really showed me that to obey is better. So I really want to thank the Lord and I want to thank God's servant. I am so, so happy that I met you. Thank you so much and God bless you.